my YouTube. I'm so freaking upset. I just don't understand. It's like, seriously, like, where the fuck is the loyalty? Where the fuck is the loyalty? Now I have to pack my shit and go to a nursing home for bariatric people, like obese people. I can't take care of myself by myself. I'm too fat. Maybe everything fucking happens for a reason. I just don't under fucking stand. I mean, I'm not gonna get into what I really want to get into because I don't want like police hold on me. But I need to get the fuck away from my family. They're toxic as fuck. They don't love me. They keep putting me in dangerous fucking situations. And they let my mental health fall apart. My physical health fall apart. And they don't give a fuck about me. So tonight I got to research nursing homes for um, obese people. I'll leave my state. I don't give a fuck. I, I don't care what legal obligations I'm under. I want to get the fuck out of here. Far away from here as possible. This is fucking bullshit. Why do I have to remember things? Because I have nightmares and then I remember them in, in fucking therapy. And then... Hi, Sin. How you doing? God bless. Good evening. And then my whole life is just like torn apart forever. Is there ever anything good going to happen to me? Like, Am I cursed? What the fuck? This is literally a fucking house of horrors living here. Thank you, Sin. I'll pray for you too. God bless you. I should be thankful I have a roof over my head. But my mental health is full. Look at my skin. This is psoriasis. It's all flaking. My skin's red to the touch. My family does not love me. Because if they did, they'd always side with me and be loyal and shit. But I need to obviously get the fuck out of here. Hey, Amaran Records. I don't want to go into it because my family's nuts and calls the police on me and shit. And I'm not talking about anyone in particular, but something happened when I was eight. So I'm going to fucking say. And my family member that I do live with still thinks it's okay to talk to him. Like nothing fucking happened. So I need to leave my house. I'm going to get my fucking ducks in a row, go to a fucking nursing home. Maybe the best thing's for me, but I'll actually get healthy now. Because, but I want to get the fuck out of New York. I'm done. Hi, Kuju. Hi, Fat Sick Motors. Probably. I'm not staying here for it. Fat Smokers. She's still talking to him. She's going to have him live here. She's full of fucking shit. And I'm not fucking staying here. So, I have resources that can help me get out of here safely. And that's it. I'm cutting my own ties. I'll get my money back to myself. My fucking SSI. And I'll live happily ever after. I'm going to be stupid as fuck to stay in this house. I'm not yelling at you guys. I'm sorry. I'm just mad about the situation. I'm going to calm down. I'm not going to, like, scream and yell and curse. Um, I've had enough. I'm heart sick. I, I, I don't know. I got to, like, get my ducks in a row and figure out what I can do. I think I have a mental health team that will help me with things that I can get help with. So I'm calling them on Tuesday. That's it. People think I'm going to just like sit here and take this. What's next? I get pregnant when I, when I don't want to. I had to have, have, I have to have an abortion. I don't fucking think so. And that's not going to happen. Shit. Not having it. I'm not fucking having it. 
Hey, Key West, fuck it. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta let it all out, girl. Thank you. Yeah. I can't keep this I can't keep this all inside. I'll have a stroke. Hey, Lexi Key, gorgeous queen. I'm not gonna go into the story again. I it's just too upsetting for me. Uh, I've been going through hell. I know you care. You're a gorgeous queen. Thank you for asking. Uh basically something happened from I remember from my past. And it's really bad. And I can't live in this house anymore because certain people want to talk to people that have hurt me. And this is not happening. I'm moving the fuck out. Like I'm I'm going. I'm not I'm cutting ties with my family too. I'm not talking to them anymore. That's it. They think it's okay for me to keep getting hurt. They think it's fucking funny. They think it's a joke. Okay. Bye. I'm gonna go live somewhere else now. No fucking loyalty. Thanks, Lexi Key. Thanks, gorgeous queen. I would give you a wrench, but this computer keeps screwing up. Um, Lexi King. But I've really just had enough now. People think they can just make me pay the fucking bills and keep hurting me. I don't fucking think so. That's not gonna happen. I'm not having it anymore. That's it. So when done being angry, calm down, and I'm going to get the fuck out of this house. I can't do this no more. I can't. I've had it. I, I just can't fucking believe this shit. I don't know how I'm staying so strong. It's the third time it's happened to me in my life. Hi, Brian. Has anyone called your house tonight? I hope not. I don't even care anymore. Who gives a shit? Hey, creature from the back room. Just tuning in again. You okay, babe? Yeah, I have to move out. And go into a nursing home. That's what's going to happen. For bariatric people. Louis Bell, hi, gorgeous queen. You're so beautiful to be upset. Thank you. And you guys are beautiful people in my family. So I'm, I'm going to done yelling and screaming. I'm going to be an adult. Calm down and think myself through this. No. No offense to Michelle Deline. I'm sure she's a wonderful person. But I don't know where I'm going to go. But I have people that can help me with this. That can assist me with this. Because this is like an emergency situation. So Creature of the Black Lagoon. Something happened to me when I was 8 years old. And my mom is still talking to the certain person that hurt me. And I'm pissed. And I I can't take it. So i rather instead of sit here and be triggered and upset mentally every day. I'm just going to go live somewhere else. And be an adult. And take care of it. And stop crying my, my eyes out. And, and bitching and complaining. Yeah, yeah, he is. No, don't say a name, Liberty. Liberty, I'm going to block you. You better retract that. I will block you. I'm not fucking kidding. I don't want any names said. Thank you. So, I just really fucking had it. This family sucks. They think it's okay to hurt me all the time. I am so fucking pissed. No, ew, what the fuck? Get out of here, I don't like you. Fucking wackadoo. Mm, dignify that with an answer. Uh, I'm not answering that. Because you people are weird and you go stalk people, no offense. So, I'm pissed. But instead of crying and cursing and screaming at people, I have to make moves. Yeah, this is a blessing in disguise, K-West. Being on my own is actually better. I don't know. She's sticking up for him. She's going to have him move here. I know that she's full of shit, and I'm not going to fucking be here for it. So I'm going to move. I'm going to make cool calls on Tuesday, Monday if I have to. Thank you, Bridget from the Black Lagoon. God bless you, sweetheart. God bless you, everybody that's giving me good advice. Mm, I, if I can, I will move to Italy in two years. If I can do it, if I'm healthy. When is she wanting him to come? Probably as soon as possible. I don't trust. I don't trust her. I think she's gonna have him move here, and I'm gonna fucking lose it. So instead of that, I'm just not gonna be living in the house. I'll be living somewhere else, and I won't even tell her where I'm going either. 
So Aspen goes, why would she let the sicko come stay in her home? She probably doesn't believe it happened to me. I'm not crazy. She probably doesn't fucking believe me. My own therapist doesn't even fucking believe me, which I need to change my therapist too. Screech in the back and goes, I can't believe this. I thought Mama Clone was on your side. Nope, she's not. Hi, Timo. Hi, beautiful queen. I'm not going into it again. Just rewatch re it. I, I just, I'm, I'm so emotionally upset. I'll go into it. I'm sorry. I'm being a bitch. I don't mean to be. I'm just very upset right now. I'm heartbroken. So my mom thinks it's okay to talk to the person that hurt me. And she's going to move him in here and I'm not going to fucking have it. Outspoken, you need to email me back because I got to talk to you. I, I need, I need like support system. When you have time, when you're available, when you can, I'm not going to bother you too much. I know you work a lot, so you're my best friend. And, um, Timo, I didn't mean for the attitude, sweetheart. I mean nothing by it. I'm just really upset. This is like a life change now. Why didn't she tell you the news? Well, I, she, I don't trust her because she, she'll she take two sides and then she she's going to be manipulated for, for and browbeaten to, to, for moving here. Oh, okay. Welcome, Timo. God bless. Um, I know it's going to happen and I'm not going to let it happen because I'm going to be out of the house. And then she can do whatever the fuck she wants to because it's her house. It's not my house. That's it. I'm going to I'm going to a nursing home. That's it. I can't live on my own. I cannot live on my own. And she's not going to be taking care of me anymore. Okay, cool. Thank you, Aspen. God bless. Thank you, man. Thanks, bud. So I have, they're going to have you guys to talk to. Get my ducks in a row. I'm going to start researching. No, I'm not reading too much into it. He's going to be coming here. He's already, he, he keeps on asking my mom, can I come live here? Can I come live there? Can I come live there? And she is not strong enough to say no to him. She says no, but she's not going to, she's going to let him come live here. And I'm not going to be raped again. Yes, Liberty Bell, take your Liberty check, disability check and move to the safe safe. That's what I'm doing. I'm in a dangerous fucking situation. I'm, I'm safe here tonight, but I need to get the fuck out of here before this uncle comes here. I fucking had enough. No, don't say. Oh my god, <sighs> please retract that, Timo. No, it's my mom's brother. Thank you. I've had it. I fucking had it. I fucking had it. I fucking had it. I am not gonna get hurt again. The little girl inside of me is screaming for protection. So I gotta be 37-year-old Heather and get to a nursing home. And that's it. I have I have Medicare, Medicaid. I'm not asking for any money for money. I'm not doing that. I have Medicare, Medicaid. I have SSI, SSD, where the fuck it is. That's it. I'm out of here. I don't care if they tell me to get up every day and shower. It'll be the best for me. Oh, they look after you there. Yeah, K-West. Hell yeah. I'll probably lose a shitload of weight, too, because I I'm not going to waste my money on fast food. Thank you, Christian Black Lagoon. It fucking bothers me. Your mom doesn't believe you. Like, what the uh, what actual fuck? I know she doesn't believe me. Because I, I told her she didn't hug me. She didn't cry. She didn't care. <laughs> she probably thinks I'm lying, which I'm not. Who the fuck would lie about Who'd want to lie about this? That's sick. Fuck her. Yeah, you can go to a nursing home. You know Tammy from Thousand Pound Sisters? She went to a nursing home. It's a bariatric nursing home. That's what I got to fucking do. And I'm not talking to my family anymore after this. I don't care if I spend Christmas alone, Hanukkah alone. I don't care. That's it. I'm done. I got to be crazy to still reside here. Yeah, I'll spend holidays with you guys if I'm allowed to stream where I am. If I'm in a nursing home, it's probably going to be pretty hard to do that. Because you really don't get your own room. So I might not be able to unless I'm out somewhere. Unless I get to a, a coffee, a coffee uh, like Starbucks or something. But yeah, I have to make my own family now, even if it's by myself. 
No, it's gonna happen, Aaron, and I'm not I'm not sitting here for it any day now. Because my uncle's girlfriend has Alzheimer's and she's going down really quick. No, it's gonna it's happening. Uh, no, I don't care about my hair anymore. It doesn't matter. Let it be ombre. I wanted to I I don't even want her touching my fucking hair at this point. Like I'm pissed. I'm going to disown my whole family. I'm not talking to them anymore. That's it. They pissed me off. I'm signing the papers to get my money back and everything else. That's it. I am so pissed off. Not because I didn't get the reaction you're going to get. Want. I know it's not about reactions because I need my family support and they don't fucking support me and I've had enough. So I got to go on my own. Oh, I'm sorry, Timo. Nobody cares. Nobody cares about me, outspoken. I have myself to rely on. That's it. And you guys. Of course, I have you, my YouTube family, thank God. But um, I had to make moves to get the fuck out of here. That's it. I gotta be crazy to stay in this house. Thank you, smiling old man. Thank you. God bless you. Ozempic, that's the least of my worries, my dear. Can't take Ozempic. It hurts my stomach, Liberty Bell. It does. I can't take it. So I have to go on a diet and exercise like the old-fashioned way. Or get bariatric surgery. I could do that while I'm in the nursing home, too. I'm on my own. That's it. I don't have family anymore. What the fuck? How? Hold on, I'll block this person. Stupid bullshit. I did. I got rid of him. I know it's a fake person. If you see guys, if you see that name, please like delete it. Mo uh, moderators, please just delete it and block them because it's not him. Don't worry about it, Greg Turkington. But thank you. So, yeah, I'm moving to the nursing home. And I'm not telling my family ever again. That's it. They lost me as a family member because they had to keep hurting me and hurting me and hurting me and hurting me. And what? To what? To have a heart attack? I don't fucking think so. I'm 37. I want to live to 100. That is not okay. Yeah. I mean, it's bullshit. Total fucking bullshit. Had enough. I gotta be insane to stay in this house. Literally fucking insane. It honestly might give you better care in the facility. Yeah. Probably. <clears throat> yeah, what up this fucking idiot? And Todd Italy, I'm going to a nursing home, so shut up. Hey Steven Andrews, how you doing? You may have to wait a while for a Medicaid better facility. I don't care. I'm getting the fuck out of here. It's an emergency. They, I have I have connections. You guys don't know that. I have connections. I can get into somewhere real quick. I don't care if they control what I eat, Greg. Greg, I need to lose weight. I'm 408 pounds. Yeah, I was in therapy when I remembered Liberty Bell. I have my therapist. But she doesn't seem to believe me, and I'm really fucking pissed, and I'm I'm switching my therapist. I love everybody, too, so... My pets? I don't give a fuck. Well, they, they're in a good place, so that's fine. Moki's going to stay here, and I'll never see Moki again because I'll be in a nursing home. Hey, Potter to us. Heather, what's happening? So, yeah, I am going to a nursing home. No, I would never make that up. No way. I wouldn't make up anything. 
Everything that's happened to me in my life is the God's honest truth. I didn't fucking lie about shit. I've said maybe white lies in my life, but nothing major. And barely ever. So, had enough. I gotta be fucking stupid to stay here. I, I can't even sleep right here because I always have nightmares. Do you guys know that I wet the bed because of all the fucking psychological stress I'm under? Do you know that? I'm maybe embarrassed, but I gotta get out of here. My body is breaking down and I don't wanna stay in this house anymore. So I need to calm down, be calm. Mind my cues and get out of here before my uncle moves in. Moki will be here. He's fine. He's safe. The animals are safe. I need to move out. Man, I am such a schmuck. Have I ever lived outside of New York? No, Aaron. And I can't leave New York because of legal reasons. So I'm going to have to stay in New York, unfortunately. Oh, Liberty Bell, you're smart. Wearing the bed is a trauma response. Be safe, queen. Yeah, well, it happened to me when I was a kid. Uh, yeah, right, I spoke again. So that's, that's my plan. Um, that's what I have to do. I gotta be crazy. I gotta be fucking crazy to stay here. Alone on holidays, alone, alone, alone. Enough. I'm tired of it. Tired of it. Oh, Paulie K says, get up, stay a little ways into the Catskills. I wish I could. I wish I had money. I would move to Italy in a fucking flash. But my health is at stake right now. My weight's 408. It's terrible. Really fake tower reader. You're an asshole. Karma's gotten to me. Everybody go spend spread some hate to fake tower reader. Cause they have no um manners. Oh, I get my karma every time, but I'm not doing anything wrong here. Thanks for blocking them. So I've just had enough. Like Likewise, but I said I just could waste it for myself. It's okay. Do what makes you happy, but be safe. But I gotta take care of my physical health, my mental health. I'm wondering why I keep on running the psych ward every every summer. Because I'm a victim of abuse. No, I can't do that. He's I wouldn't impose on him like that. Yeah, Ram Truckers is a nice idea. I'm not even going to say I'm not starting with him. Oh, no. But thank you, Aaron. Um, yeah, it's time. I didn't make moves. I don't know how the hell I'm going to find a good nursing home, but... Yeah. Thank you, Timo. Yeah, I got to separate myself from my family. This is no fucking good. It's a shame I can't get Section 8 housing, but I can't take care of myself. Thanks, Pot of Sauce. I wish your mom would tell him. No, I know, right? I always got room for the queen. Maybe one day outspoken, but I don't want to... Uh, my health is so bad right now. Like, I can't even move anywhere like that. I wouldn't make it for the trip because I could get blood clots, traveling all the way to the other side of the country. Hi, Big. You got this, queen. Thank you. God bless. So, um... Yeah, I'm done. I mean, people just don't fucking listen to me when I tell them, you know, I'm hurt and you want to still associate with this person. What the fuck is wrong with you? So, you know what? Now I take my money and go. Goodbye. That's it. 
I'm not going to sit there and yell at my mother and be an asshole. I'll just fucking pack my shit and go. People are fucking stupid. Not you guys, but the people in my life that continue to hurt me are fucking stupid. You know, I got to be on my own. It's called me, myself, and I. That's the way it is. And I have you guys, but you know what I mean. I'm going to have to just... Oh, man, I wish I would have finished college and had a career or did a trade so I have money to back me up. Unfortunately, I'm disabled. Nah, I have to, I have to leave, I have to leave Timo. I can't stay here. My will move in, we will support you during this transition. I don't know, but I'm going to, I'll make it vocals calls on Tuesday. I'm pissed. Thank you, Asshole. Your mom really needs to say no. This is so wrong. I know. It's very wrong. Yeah, well, I will not let him near me because I'm telling you, I got to get out of this house. I don't know if I'm going to have to go back to the psych ward. I don't know what the fuck I'm going to have to do. And nobody call. I'm fine. I love life. When does he arrive? I don't know, but it may be soon. I have probably maybe about two weeks. And I got to tell my team that. Hi, Brandy. Hey, gorgeous queen. Hello, queen other. So I have two weeks. I have two weeks to get my ducks in a row and get the fuck out of here. That's it. And I'm going to a nursing home. Can't stay here. Can't stay here. I'm falling apart. I'm, I'm peeing the bed. I'm eating like a pig. My skin's falling apart. I have fucking shingles again. I know I have shingles again. My mom's a moron. She's like, oh, it's just a rash. Uh, no, stupid. I have body pain and back spasms, and now I have a rash on, on my ribcage. Again, fucking shingles. <laughs> And I know, I know I've spoken, but no, I'm not staying here. I I'm on probation. I can get in trouble. If I start a fucking scene and the cops are called, forget it. I'm getting out of the house. I can't do this no more. Two weeks. I, I have two weeks to just keep fucking calm, pack my fucking shit, and get the fuck out of here. And it's an emergency situation. I need to get out of here. And I can't even leave New York, which sucks. Well, I'm going to go because I'm putting myself in danger by talking about all this shit, which sucks. I can't even do that because somebody will take it the wrong way and call the fucking cops on me and I'll fucking lose it. I'm falling apart. But I'm going to be fine because I'm going to be strong. Maybe. No, I'm not. I'm not talking about the wrong people, but I've had enough. Look at me. I'm falling apart. Wrinkles, this, that. Oh, I'm sorry, Brian. Yeah, I gotta protect myself. So I'm going to go. I have to do some research and figure out nursing homes and shit like that. I'm going to be making a lot of fucking phone calls on Tuesday. I can't do this no more. I can't be here. I can't be in living in this house. It's just not happening. I want to live life. Don't take it wrong. I'm living my life. I'm deleting this video because I want to get in fucking trouble. God forbid. Don't need that. But uh, I just need to talk to you guys. I'm really nervous about this. I'm nervous about it too, but can't take it. Thank you, Mary Sony. Take care of yourself, Heather. We got to feel safe in your space. I'll update you guys. If I'm not online, just know I'm in a nursing home. I mean, I have my email. You can always reach out to my email if you want an update. Okay, Narf, you're a fucking asshole. Get out of here. I don't know why your mother's... Never mind. I'm not going to go there. He's probably not even him. Bye, Narf. Oh, 
oh, look who it is, the abuser. You fucking piece of shit. I had enough. I, I can't fucking deal with this no more. I'm not fucking playing games. Well, I'm going to go delete this, this video and... um. You're getting blocked, too. I gotta stay strong. All right, guys. I gotta go. Love you all. If you don't hear from me, I'm in a nursing home. Yeah, well. Shit happens, right? All right, yeah, I'll, I'll take your phone call outspoken. Thank you. And happy Memorial Day to everybody. Sorry about my drama. I apologize. Um, sweet dreams. <laughs>